So this is a piece of EU sawmill I've cut from last week. And I thought I can do something with this instead of just throwing it onto the firewood pile. So there was that burr looking bump on the side of that log. And I thought that could be ideal for ball turning. So that's what I'm going to do today, turning a U burr ball. This is obviously green wood and far from being seasoned. It isn't really ideal to finish turn a ball from green wood, but well, I'm going to do it anyway just because I want to have fun and uh, you is a very stable wood so I'm not really worried about that piece cracking up or uh, warping and checking I'm pretty sure it's gonna work out just fine obviously I am limited with the type of finishes I can put on this ball I'm going to use oil and wax and I'm going to apply additional coats of oil to this ball definitely for the first week or two Please note that U wood has toxic properties and for that reason I'm going to use this ball only for decorative purposes and it should never come in contact with food. And I also like to mention that I'm just a guy who likes to do wood turning once in a while and my technique of wood turning is pretty poor. And I'm absolutely clear about that but I'm not here to teach you wood turning, I just like to show you something I enjoy. So I have drawn up a circle onto it and cut the excess off in a hand saw. I'm trying to get it close to round and somewhat balanced, but not very successfully. When I started turning, it was shaking so hard, I thought it's gonna rip off the lathe from my workbench. But at the end, it worked out just fine.
So as you can see, I have some holes and loose bits of bark on this ball. Uh, I was hoping that I can turn them out, but obviously the burr wasn't big enough for it. But I think they're gonna be a cool feature. I just need to stabilize the loose bits of bark. For that purpose, I'm using a Ronsell product, which is a wet rot wood hardener. There was no particular reason for that product. This is what I had laying around.